Hello there everybody, it is the Vaping Queen and I am back at you with a uh, review on the Drag Rupu. Yes guys, I am loving this mod. Um, I'm really mad that I got these and now the new ones came out, but it's whatever. Some people may not like the new ones, they might not like the color, like the stab wood, I believe that is on there. They are going to be being sent to me, but I had these to review on, and I do really like these. The only thing is, when you get these, they stink really bad, like machinery oil. And I have cleaned mine a million times, and it still has a smell to it. So, make sure that you guys clean these really, really good, and keep, um... my brain is keep this near you so you can put it on your hands after handling it until you get to a sink to wash your hands um let me just show you it comes in this box right here it tells you whoops what's in here what's in it right here and it has a warning it has your all the authenticity scratch here um you open this <sighs> of course your mod will be right here pull this up you will have your user's manual here is your warranty card make sure you fill this out your you your firmware upgradable please don't charge your devices that way please get an external charger and here's your little card that tells you this device is charged is um, powered by the gene chip love 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 the gene chip I really really do um, I have quite a few mods that have the gene chip in it and I absolutely love them so let me just tell you a little bit about this mod guys it is five clicks one two three four five two three four five off one two three four five on um three clicks will take you into your menu so you can pick between like your uh tc settings this has stainless steel 316 um titanium um nichrome and i believe this does have two pre-settings I love this mod. It is a very hard hitting mod. Um, it doesn't like have a really big ramp up time. I, I, I don't think it has any. Like you just get your hit right away. Um, it says, all right, so the safety protections on here is battery reverse pre um, protection, switch timeout protection, over temperature protection, um, output over current protection, overcharge protection, over discharge protection, short circuit protection, supports balance charge with different brand batteries. That might be true, but I just think you should always ch charge your batteries on an external battery charger. Um, like I said, it's five clicks on, five clicks off. Um, you press the fire button three times, that'll get you into your menu. It's 100 Celsius to 315 Celsius and 200 Fahrenheit to 600 Fahrenheit um, and I'm not too sure what the adjustable um, wattage is but it says that this is goes up to um, whoops one two three I gotta get back in the wattage this goes up to 157 watts um, and it does go pretty quick it goes by ones thank god um, but it says on here that you can adjust your interface um, it says quickly press the fire button four times can get you into wattage adjustment interface when uh, then you will see 
the letter W is flashing. The adjustable wattage is 5 watts to 80 watts. I don't really play around with that. So, if you know what that is, I mean, I, I know what it is, but I just don't, I just don't mess around. I don't go in my menus too often unless I have to fix something because I just keep my stuff on the same thing. I don't really do temperature control, so I don't have any need for that. But, yeah, it has sleep mode. Um, if there's no operation within 30 seconds, the screen will turn off. Um, no operation for 30 minutes after the screen, uh, the screen will turn off. The device will enter sleep mode. Um, if resistant was charged before sleeping mode, screen will prompt yes or no on interface. If resistant was charged in sleep mode, screen will prompt yes or no on the interface. Press any key to recover display from sleep mode. Um, it's just everything that is on for, you know, any mod. But guys, I just want to tell you, don't remove this sticker because if you do, your warranty is no good. Um, really nice magnets. I, I really do like this. The only thing is, like I said, it's hard to get the machine oil off. And um, it does get dirty really quick. But, I mean, you just have to wipe it. I absolutely love how this mod hits. And you can fit up to a 25 millimeter on here very comfortably, no overhang. So yeah guys, that is all I have for you on the drag by Vupu. You guys know what to do. Like, share, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social medias. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.